Vibration transmits from a rotating shaft through the bearing, into the bearing housing, and into our sensor. The sensor converts mechanical energy to electrical signal. From the sensor, the signal transmits down the cable to our tester. Rotating shafts vibrate in three directions, up and down, back and forth, and side to side. The triaxial sensor measures all three directions simultaneously. Mount the sensor either on the top or on the side or on the end. It doesn't matter whichever is the best. But keep in mind some key points. And these key points are mount the sensor on solid metal in direct path to the bearing and make sure the magnet is securely mounted. Make sure the machine is running at normal operating conditions and keep in mind that vibration transmits through the entire machine and through the foundation and from adjacent machines. The 810 is designed to help you obtain good measurements. There's three screens that make this process easy. On the first screen, use the machine icon and select the bearing location the sensor is on. Notice that the current bearing location is for bearing number two, which is on the motor. To start the measurement, we would press measure. To go to the next location, we would press next location. The image on the right shows how sensor location numbering follows the flow of energy down a machine. Use the quick reference guide that helps the user make correct measurements while in the field. Sometimes the machine icon that's on the tester looks different than your machine. The machine icon is simply a guide to help you select the bearing locations for your measurements. So sometimes we'll show a horizontal machine that will represent both a horizontal machine and a vertical machine. Or for a belt driven machine, we might show the motor, belt, and fan as in one line where in reality the motor and the fan or pump are side by side or on top of each other. We talked about the first screen which was to select the location of the sensor. The next two screens are to number one or B would be to select the orientation of the machine. So we would use the dial to select either the end of the machine the top or bottom, or the side. Then we would select the direction of the cable coming out of the side of the sensor. So if the cable is coming out perpendicular to the shaft or in line with the shaft. These three screens help the 810 know which direction the three sensors in the triax are measuring the three planes or the movement of the machine.